Debs doing the driving, fantastic work, made it in one piece, so yeah, it's been a good day, good couple of days, holy shit, so we'll take a few photos now and then, yeah, see what happens after that. Alright, so that was the inaugural trip, how did it feel? Oh mate, that was unreal man, it's driving through the streets right. of Chennai, it's golden hour, and <laughs> sun's yeah, going down, a, a and... feeling, eh? yeah, I yeah. oh, look like fun, I'm looking forward to my turn. <laughs> yeah, my my passenger said I was a pretty damn good auto rickshaw driver. So we'll wait till they see me then. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we're actually at the Hall of Fame at the moment, but Kill hasn't turned up yet, he's, he's on his way but he's not quite here yet so we're not far from the beach but so we've decided to head down do a few laps around the beach and then park up and get some photos before we uh, before the sun sets it's almost down so yeah. <laughs> yeah, boy. yeah.
Yes, hips are so small, no? Yeah. They are goats. Goats, goats, goats. Yes. So we're just down on the main beach at Chennai and uh, we just did a bit of a photo shoot. Some of them photos came out really well actually. I'm sure you'll see them. And uh, just going to get Al, he's gone down the beach to take a few photos. All right, so we've been stuck in Chennai peak hour traffic for like, I don't know, probably about 40 minutes now, and we've traveled about 40 meters. Uh, I think the, uh, took, the rickshaw may have overheated. There's something wrong with the clutch, I think, at the moment. So we've just pulled over to have a look and uh, let, let the engine cool down a bit. <laughs> no, I've got him here. Oh, you have? Do you want to yeah. grab him? So what are you adjusting there, Al? Uh, I'm fairly certain I'm putting the... So the, obviously this is the adjustment for the clutch, and this is the bolt that holds the actual whole cable in place. Yep. And that it rattled off, so... Ah, oh, righto. I'm just... I don't know, actually, but I can't work it out if it's an adjustment or if it's... I just need to keep doing it until it's tight. We'll see what happens if I do it up. That feels pretty good, actually. Alright, so we've had our first official breakdown. And uh, the boys are onto it. Hopefully, we get it sorted. Right. Yeah, we'll try. Just once more. Okay. It seems we have fixed it. But, uh. Start just creeping forward again then, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Well, we actually moved a bit forward, so that's pretty good. That's a good sign that was working. But uh, yeah, now we've still got to battle this traffic, and uh, hopefully she doesn't have to eat. We'll see how we go. Uh. 
Hey guys, how's it going? Yeah, as you can tell, we made it back to the hostel in one piece. It's a pretty hectic drive there through Chennai peak hour traffic. Plan was not to really drive the uh, rickshaw too much through the night. It gets a bit dangerous. Yeah, we kind of were running, running a bit behind time. We are having a bit too much fun with the boys and time slipped away from us there. Yeah, shout outs to T3K, the graffiti crew. Man, those guys, what, a, what an amazing three days. First three days in India. Instantly hit it off with those boys and yeah, showed us around, introduced us to a whole bunch of their friends. Spent a good few days there you know, having fun and drinking beers and getting to know each other. They're kind of like brothers to us now. As you've seen, they've done an amazing job on our rickshaw. Absolutely amazing. Thanks for hooking us up there, guys. Appreciate it. Yeah, so now me and Al just uh, ordered food in tonight. We're just probably gonna have a pretty quiet one tonight. And we just use the, uh, the local kind of Uber Eats type app. I'm not sure what it's called, but um, I'm sure we'll use it again, so I'll let you know what it is. And then tomorrow, got a pretty big day plan we want to get a like a battery installed in our rickshaw it doesn't have a battery at the moment so then we can uh, buy a set of speakers and and get a sound system in there uh, we also want to get like um, I don't know if we want to get like roof racks for the top or I don't know maybe some kind of lockable compartment or something that can go up there on top welded to the top or something um, so that you know if we're for starters so we've got somewhere to put our backpacks and everything and also you know if we're if we're driving we're going to be doing a lot of driving around India and and you know we might want to pull up somewhere and go check out some of them so we need somewhere where we can securely lock up our gear my sim card still not working you know I got the sim card you meant to wait 24 hours for it to um, activate we did that we waited 48 hours for it to activate and then uh, we went down to the Airtel shop. I paid the 445 Indian rupees and you get uh, unlimited calls and 84 gigs of data over 84 days. That's one, so you get one gig of data per day for 84 days. So that's awesome deal. That's like um, less than $10 Australian. So yeah, just goes to show you how much we're getting rorted in Australia by, by you, Telstra. I'm looking at you, Telstra, but still, Nonetheless, it's still not working, so you know. So I'm gonna go back down there tomorrow and tell them, you know, what's up and see if they can sort it out. But yeah, apart from that, we might call it a night tonight, I think. Yeah, it's been a big day. It's been a big few days. It's been great. Wouldn't have it any other way, so yeah. I guess uh, I'll sign out here and I'll catch us in the morning. Peace.